Today we're at JC Farms with John and Sarah Kringle. Um, they are nominees from our Arkansas Young Farmers and Ranchers Excellence in Ag. Guys, thank you so much for having us today. Appreciate it. Um, yes, I wanted to know, since you are nominees, you know, how, what's the history behind, behind JC Farms? How did this get started? Well, it's, it's not anything typical or anything, you know, so yeah. I'm ag teacher here at Bismarck, and so I graduated from here when I came home and got started. We had a piece of property that this, the FFA kids get to cut hay, or the hay's cut off and the, benefit, the proceeds go to the FFA kids. Mm -hmm. And the gentleman that lived here at the time was the one cutting the hay, so as ag teacher, I go to talk to him, and he said, you got a place bought yet? I said, no, we're looking. He said, well, I just happen to be selling this one. And so we just kind of Went from there, and here we go, buying cows and, yeah. and uh, hay on. equipment. And both first-time farmers. First-time farmers. Oh. Yeah. yeah. And how long? How long have y'all been doing it now? Uh, we bought this place the summer of 2015. <laughs> We're in a little bit of everything. We yeah. are, I guess, farm-wise. We we run around 60, 70 head of just commercial cows, predominantly black, black, white face, and running some. Uh, semi-angus bulls and then we've got a few Hereford influenced cows that we're, we're running a brimmer bull on and, and, but then we uh, we do we rodeo and, and work off horseback a lot with our cattle and, and kind of do it that way and we have a lot of kids through here um, when they go on vacation or if they don't have a place to keep an animal we can do different things where they can keep their projects here and we can work with them and help them and teach them their show livestock show projects. So, and like I said, first generation, just yeah. not knowing, and, and a lot of just taking people's advice that we look up to, and just you know trying to work it out together and figure out who's you know there's not really any one thing that you're responsible for this, I'm responsible for that, or it's just uh, there's there's always a list of things done, and it's just what do you what do you want to tackle off that list and what do I want to tackle or what do we need to do together? <laughs> yeah. so. Some days I'm putting hay out, some days he's doing the laundry. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. we, we just, it's, it's not anyone's job, it's both right. of ours. Right. Yeah, what, what keeps you day after day coming back and doing this? Just the two girls, they're our, our biggest focus and the farm is already just, it's making them into good citizens. We're, we're raising the youth of our country, so I think this is the, the best place to do it. 